I had a little bit of a crisis this morning, though, that I wanted to tell you about. So oh. I, you know, you guys know I have these chickens, right? I have three chickens. Yeah. They live in the backyard. Oh, they, they have, all know about it. They haven't laid an egg. They've been freeloading at my They've house. They've been hanging since out July. in the office. And yeah. You've been telling them about it too. Uh, well, okay. So, so here's what happened. So this morning, I'm like racing out the door, and it's one of those days where I'm like grabbing eight million things. I'm trying to run. I'm trying to get out the door, and I see that I had a voicemail, and it's my neighbor who left me a message. Oh no. So I'm like, okay, well, and sometimes they'll call me if they're gonna go out of town or something we have a good neighborly relationship my neighbor That's Sam and sweet. Steve they're really great so I get this message and it's Steve and he's like hey Elizabeth your dang chickens are in our yard and so I was like Eek. so dang I'm in the chickens? car yeah he's laughing he was, oh, he was okay. laughing very hard but he called them dang chickens so it was pretty funny so so I call him so I'm in the car I'm just about to peel out slowly and safely and I cruise back around into the alley and I call Steve and I'm like Steve what's up and he's like there's a hole in the fence and the chickens got through so there's like you know we have kind of this shoddy fence between our houses it's it's that's just the way that it is so one of the little fence you know panel things fell off the chickens go right through so here's what happened I get back to the backyard and this is what's so funny about these chickens is they have so much personality so I get to the backyard I'm going through I'm telling Steve I'm gonna get these chickens he's like it's fine let them run whatever and I'm like I'm gonna get these chickens so I go into Sam and Steve's backyard and there's two of them over there I have three of them Steve's having chicken for dinner yeah these two <laughs> this is Roz and Susie okay Roz and Susie Q are just free loading off the treats that they're finding in the backyard of my neighbors they're yeah. running all around meanwhile I go into my backyard and the other chicken Marianne is just squawking in total fear and paranoia she's like my sisters have left me I have no idea what to do I just have to know that I have to stay close to home but it's so funny because that's totally their personalities like Roz and Susie would be the ones to break free and make a run for it and then Marianne would cower in fear and sit at home and uh, the moral of the story is I got the chickens back and thanks to Sam and Steve for what being a nice, nice neighbor huh? aren't they nice I know but they you know they have dogs and so they were like we just didn't want the dogs to get them but yeah. the dogs are inside for the day so if they want to play in our yard too and I was like no 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 so I go into Sam and Steve's yard and I was like what do you got what do you think you're doing scoot your boots right through that hole back into the yard uh -huh. and, and then they did and then they did do and they then... fetch as well what do they what else no. do they do no but they eat stuff and and that was it so anyway that was my, my chicken adventure. If they'd lay an egg, I would be happy, but it hasn't happened yet. <laughs>